statistics box and whisker diagrams question the table below shows the time taken in minutes by an office worker to commute to work in 10 consecutive days it's given here in minutes 10 numbers part a find the smallest and the largest values of this data set part b find the median of this data set part c find the lower quartile of this data set part d find the upper quartile of this data set finally part e draw a box and whisker diagram for this data set let's begin so what's given here are these numbers the time taken to commute in minutes in, a ran in random order so first we should arrange this data in order of size starting with the smallest number which is number 14 in this case so we'll draw a table here it's a blank table now and our task here is to fill up the numbers in this table starting with number 14 the lowest number so lowest number is 14 here and next number is 50 and next one is 16 and next one is 17 there are two 17s here 17 seven and 17 and the next one is number 18 there are two 18s again 18 and 18 and 119 there and 120 there and lastly the f largest number number 21 there so we already found one answer the lowest number the smallest number was number 14 and now we found the largest number is 21 so therefore our next answer is what is the largest value is number 21 basically 21 minutes precisely because this is in minutes and this is actually the smallest number is actually 14 minutes the commute time for commute and then next target is to find the position of the median so what is the position of the median basically we need to find out the middle of these numbers there are 10 numbers if you have n numbers normally what you do is half of n plus one position is the median value position will give us the median so for this case the position of the median is half time n is 10 there are 10 numbers plus 1 means that five and a half position so basically it's in between 17 and 18 here the median should be here so that means the median in this case is equal to the average of 17 plus 17 and 18 average of 17 and 18 because it is, seven, it is in between 17 and 18 so that will give us the answer to the median 17 and a half that is the median value of this data set okay next we look at We'll take the data that we have arranged already so it's the lowest to the highest and now we need to find out the lower quartile so what we have to do is we now look at the data to the left of the median so median was here 
and then we need to find out the data to the left of the median there are five numbers there so the position of the lower quartile position of the lower quartile is equal to half time there are five numbers on the left one two three four five five plus one which is equal to three and the third number is the lower quartile of this data sequence means lower quartile is 16 similarly we need to look at the numbers right to the median there are five numbers so we look at the data to the right of the median there are five again it should be half time five plus one the third number one two three is the is the number 19 is the upper quartile so upper quartile is upper quartile is 19 so now we found median lower quartile and upper quartile also we found the lowest number and the highest number so these are the numbers that we found already smallest value lowest number largest value the highest number 21 and the median was 17.5 lower quartile 16 and upper quartile 19 now our task is to draw a box and whisker diagram for this data so the grid is given it can start from any number in this case 13 to 22 so now our task is to uh, indicate these numbers in this grid here. So we'll find the first one is the lowest value, the smallest value, number 14 here, and the largest value 21 here, and the median 17.5, 17, 18, 17.5, longer, uh, longer line there and the lower quartile 16 somewhere here and upper quartile 19 somewhere here so we have all the boundaries so this will be the box here starting from the lower quartile to upper quartile and then the whiskers are starting from the lowest value lower quartile and from upper quartile to the highest value these are two whiskers and this is a box so that's what called a uh, box and whisker diagram that's the final answer to this question box and whisker diagrams